Previously on Oathsworn. Accompany Sarah Colley as she confronts Whisper, disrupt the ritual, and distract the Never Army long enough to give the Legion time to break through the siege. Sarah Colley can't shoot a gun, can she? It would be my honor. If I lose myself out there, will you help me out of it or will you utilize me? Before you know it, there is a flare of light, of sickly bright starlight close to the ritual. And you realize that things are moving faster than you had expected. I'm adding a clock for Whisper's ritual. It is an eight step clock and I'm ticking it twice. Um, You can resist it. Can Nikolaj use the truth will out? Oh, this is true. Yeah. Say more about that. You may expend your special armor to resist consequences of lack of knowledge or obfuscation. Absolutely, you can. Might do that then. How yeah. to, though? You knew the, the pace of the ritual. Yeah. Oh, Christ. That's terrifying. Uh-huh. <laughs> Why do you know that, sir? You studied your part in the prophecy. Yes, indeed. Uh. That would be wild if part of the prophecy that he read about was, like, today. Well, he's here. Yeah. And I don't, I've been alluding to the fact that Eyes of Smoke people will read everything about their own futures yeah. if given oh, a chance. Oh, huh. That almost feels like taboo. I think it's taboo, and all of them do it. Yeah. <laughs> and everyone does it anyway. Yeah, it's like the Jedi having wives. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah. I never met Yoda's wife, unfortunately. You never met Yaddle? <laughs> That's a real thing. <laughs> Enough. <laughs> <laughs> Who just made the Yoda noise? <laughs> Be God, foul spirit. Um, uh, Nikolaj explains this to Lance. Lance turns to Siracali and says, Change of plans, fire. <laughs> <laughs> Damn. Okay. Uh, how much did that, that reduce the clock by? All. Hell yeah. Yeah. Okay. No, uh, absolutely. If you spent your spark, yeah, that took it down from two ticks to zero ticks. Hey, Nikolaj. Hello. You saw, um, uh, whisper through the lens. Is that right? Probably. Yeah. Uh-huh. Um, who's the person that you most, uh, care about? Oh no. Oh, I forgot about that. Uh, most care about. <laughs> There's a part of me that wants to just say Nikolaj. Um, <laughs> I was going to say the same thing. <laughs> There's just a thought of Nikolaj just sitting happily in a library somewhere, unbothered, surrounded by books with information on literally everything. Hmm. I think a lot of people see themselves. <laughs> it's like the, it's like the, yeah, if the Lyceum was like the one from Avatar Last Airbender, there's that that guy who just likes just like, hey, the, the library is sinking into the ground. You're going to come with us? And he's like, no. And is smiling. Yeah. That's Nikolaj. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Whisper looks just like that. 
dying with all the answers. Good. Sarah Kali looks down the sights of the gun. I don't know if we know what Whisper looks like to Sarah Kali. Or maybe Chosen or Sarah Kali particularly can see Whisper for who she truly is. I, I'm not sure. But Whisper's there at the top of a circle of idols, all surrounding a big magic circle painted on the ground in this plaza. Their arms are lifted and they're singing something, almost like a choir. And there's this moment where Whisper realizes that Sarah Kali is looking at him because, of course, how could he not notice that? They probably see Sarah Kali's eyes glint in the distance like a divine sniper scope. And then just as he realizes it, the shot comes right between the eyes, faster than the sound that made it. And Whisper flies backwards, head first, some 30 feet through the air, landing with such an impact that there is a crater, a scar in the earth where he lands. And for just a moment, the broken is gone. But the idols around the circle continue singing. Okay, Vipers, let's move. Uh, group move to close the gap. Yeah. All right. Okay. Desperate standard. Does scale do anything here? No. Because I can improve scale up or down. Yeah, I mean, you are vastly outnumbered at present. Okay. I guess all that matters is we count multiple sixes as a critical here. Ooh. Okay, well, I got one. Well, that's good news. Well, we'll take one. All right. We'll take one. No stress, though. I've rolled twice and I've gotten two sixes. Surely that will continue. <laughs> that's how <laughs> yeah. odds work. That's Don't change anything. Absolutely. You just had to say something. Never change a thing. <laughs> now that'll do it are we just like parkouring <laughs> between buildings no it, this is this is very like saving private ryan running back down the stairs being very careful about corners moving in a straight line like this everyone's like behind the person in front of them single file single single file Uh, Moving single file, it's very, like, you're all soldiers. You all have the training. Uh, Suleiman, I guess, is in the middle. Uh, (laughs) Ashling's taking up the rear, and he's holding, like, a grenade this whole time. Ready to to unleash if anything pops up out of of a corner, or from around Um, a corner. There's an explosion, and for a half second, you think that maybe it's one of yours. (laughs) But... It's not. They, the city is shelling your location. Cool. Ah, oh, fuck. They are f- firing artillery trying to stop the surge of never. What do you do? Uh, we've been through worse. What does our surroundings look like in terms of threats? There's never like surging through the streets as if there's like a riot going on. They are like flooding through the streets Towards towards the city. Okay. Lance unfurls the banner and hangs it on the back of his armor. Uh, it, it's probably, you know, a full human length high above him so that everyone can see, including the never. And he's shouting a V formation. Ducks. 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 <laughs> what? <laughs> First thought. Mighty ducks. The mighty sorry. ducks. Uh, this is a real formation, guys. This is a thing. <laughs> yeah, oh, and, and the mighty ducks did it. Yeah, I know. Okay. The mighty ducks used it. Uh, this is my most familiar thought. Captain, would you like me to make a distraction? What, what did you have in mind, soldier? I'm already holding a grenade, and I pull out some, like, just nasty, stinky, like, salve from my, like, med kit. Oh. What if I just, uh, you know, combine these two things? <laughs> Smells just like home. <laughs> Did you grow up in a, a medical tent? 
Yeah. Uh, we need to, we need to, let's say there's like a, a density of never that we have to get through. Yeah. I'm, I'm, I'm just like maybe like throwing behind us to like give us some more space, just something besides a group maneuver to fill this clock, you know? Yeah. It sounds like a setup action. Yeah. I think that's a setup. Oh, okay. But that's, that's very good. That'd be a good thing to do. I mean, it would still pump the clock probably if, it, if it's trying to clear space. I, I mean, you could you, you could do this and make the, the group action risky. Oh, I would let that happen. Oh, yeah, that was desperate. So Mark Prowess, everyone. <laughs> oh, my yeah. God. Um, Fuck, I wish Aoife was on this mission. She needs that XP. <laughs> yeah, uh, I guess it, like if there's a density of never that we have to get past and you throw it like off to the side that would be to get them to go in that direction or away yeah from that was the direction. that was the idea for sure yeah. i love okay. that cool um that's wreck probably right yeah I'm wreck. Just throwing a grenade willy-nilly to blow some shit up desperate standard cool cool anyone want to help on this i can help cool i'll push myself too it's um it's medical supplies right yeah so i think that nabane is able to like point out in your pack oh actually this will be smellier when it's burning Ooh, i like that <laughs> cool i'm gonna do 3d6 risky standard six hell yeah six Ooh. excellent yeah love to there see it go. stink bomb yeah love to see it tell me what happens uh i think i have like a since i have lots of like pockets and like vests and stuff like that i feel like i also have like small bags and mm-hmm. i fill the bag kind of with like the the salve and then i take the pin out of the grenade drop it into the bag and then like use the string of the bag to like throw it down a nice down uh, an alleyway and i yell uh come smell this jesus (laughs) (laughs) smell my shorts okay yeah you can um uh for this role the the position is risky sick these never are good, like the, the feral, like surge towards the sound and the smell and like the hex are like tripping over them. It smells like lavender and sulfur. Charge into the ritual. Lance draws his, uh, his spear and points. Oh, it's weapons time. Okay. <laughs> I pull out my anchor, my extremely uh, inefficient anime weapon. Let Let's... Go. <laughs> What's the Star Viper battle cry? I thought we were hissing. You can't really hiss loud. <laughs> hiss, hiss, motherfucker. <laughs> it's just some rattling. That would be cool if we all had like a little implement, like a little maraca thing that was like around our dog tags or something. Yeah, or it's like tied to our weapons. So like we're shaking them to rattle them as we're charging. Yeah, that's fun. That's sick. Yeah. Okay, group maneuver. Okay. Risky standard. Oh, five this time. (laughs) Six. There's a six still. Okay, I take one stress. Go on. Okay. Uh, If Lance trauma's out, he's dead. Just saying. Um, Uh. Okay, stop taking stress. (laughs) It's okay. It's only been four stress so far. It used to be a place for markets and for festivals, and now it is filled with rubble and fire. The tides have never streamed past this place, coursing towards the city, ignoring you for now. Three things stand out. One is the big crater where Whisper landed. Two is the group of idols, half a dozen of them singing around the magic circle 
in discordant melody. And three is a star in the sky above, which has made a trail of light as the ritual drags it towards the ground itself. The sound makes Ashling start to twitch and their eyes start to go bloodshot and they start to lick their teeth. Good. Good, good, good. Chris, I think you had something. Uh, yeah, I wanted to know if Nikolaj could have a flashback here, because this is my design, says so I can experience a flashback that I did not personally witness, as mm. long as you have a sense memory on hand of someone who was there. But I'm wondering if I can get a flashback to see, like, how the ritual was set up so I know how to undo it or how to stop it. That's cool. Yeah, 100%. Um, what sense memory do you focus in on? Ooh, the the music feels like a big one. I I enjoyed the discord and singing as a as a description of a thing. Mm-hmm. So it's I just imagine like that, like he just keys in on on like one of the particular voices, and it like starts playing backwards to him, and it just like rewinds shit. Yeah, absolutely. So I think what. I would do here is have you roll gather information. Okay. And mark one stress for doing that. Sure. And based on your roll, we'll see what you can learn. Righty. Uh, I, I, I would want to roll research. Yeah. Research is absolutely it. Okay. Fantastic. That's 2d6. Oh, Christ. That's a three. <laughs> oh my gosh. Christ. Right. I'm so sorry. Uh, that's all right. You still get a question. Uh, that's true. Um, oh, what to ask? Because uh, there's a part of me that wants to uh, uh, avoid the whole like we we just have to sing at it because we kind of did that at the star. Sure. Um, I was going to say, how many of the idols do we actually need to kill? Like minimum. Yeah, something like what's the what's the least amount? Like what is the quickest, most expedient way to you know, disrupt this? Like, is it taking out the idols? Is it something about the sigil on the ground? Is there some other environmental factor? Right. Absolutely. So, you know, two things here to be true. One is that there are six idols here. There are many others in the town around you. If Whisper truly wants to, like, make sure that there are replacements and resume this ritual just by, like, finding new bodies to take their places then they can do that. Absolutely. Um, Shit. But the other thing that you know is what Azar knew about the way that Whisper's forces are forced to fight, which is that if directed towards a purpose, then they will surge towards it with incredible force. But they have an incredibly difficult time reconvening themselves, uh, realigning themselves. And so if you were able to disrupt the ritual's progress and then destroy it in some way then you might be able to stop it okay i i think nicolaj will tell lance this um the other thing i think that you would know just from knowing from looking at the ritual is that this is the sort of thing that they don't have a lot of opportunity to do if you were to interrupt or even complete this one in some way they wouldn't be able to do it again for a long, long time. Ah, uh, the stars have aligned. Something mm. like that. You can either consume the components or destroy them. Um, and whichever it is that happens, that they won't be able to repeat this again for a long time. Okay. And the components are, it's a magic circle. Yeah, there's blood that's been painted across the ground. There's um, little totems that have been set up in a circle around. That's They're all right. pondering an orb. Exactly. 100%. Okay. Uh, Lance shoots the flare. Oh, uh, excellent. So Sarah Kali, if she hadn't taken the liberty to take that second shot, she can now yep. or should now. And we're gonna, we're just gonna bust on in and murder this idol right here. I think. Great. In a group skirmish. Oh, I have zero dice in that. Good. Can I shoot? Because Nikolaj has a gun, but not so. Oh, I guess he does have a hand weapon, but 
feel like it's probably worse with that. I suppose they're equally bad. If we want to do a group shoot, uh, it's the same for me. I have. It's three. better for Nabane. Yeah, I have three dice and shoot, no dice and skirmish. Damn. Mm-hmm. I mean, I have zero in either, but okay. a black shot, and that feels like it should help. It is net more dice if we group shoot first. I just rolled to see if uh, Sarah Colley's jacket catches fire from the Soleimon sniper rifle, and <laughs> uh, four was going to be the 25% chance that it doesn't, and it didn't. <laughs> Soleimon does good work, apparently. <laughs> <laughs> Outstanding. Some of my best sniper rifle. <laughs> No, 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 no. Okay, so I think what this looks like is we all line up uh, and Lance, uh, the the specialists are like crouching with their weapons and all of the soldiers are lined up with muskets on shoulders and Suleiman is told to watch the back but is probably going to watch what happens when we shoot. Sure. <laughs> and this is still desperate? It is. Or did, or did we get to risk? Oh, darn. No, nope, it was just for that roll. We were briefly in risky. <gasps> wow. That's a crit. Wow. Wow. That's a crit. That's a double crit. Whoa. That's, oh my that's a God. double crit. That's oh, my God. oh, my God. Oh, my God. We over. win. Mission's we win over. the mission. Can we yeah, get a double over. crit? Good can, game. We, can we do we, that? We fade to black. <laughs> roll credits. <laughs> <laughs> An 80s power uh, anthem is playing over the end credits. Yeah. Wow. This is just a fucking we, we firing see, squad. like, Lance old with a beard has a kid now uh in a rocking chair um Walut is like harvesting wheat and like wipes the sweat off her forehead chimney crickets Suleiman died yeah. tragically <laughs> Suleiman the happy ending Suleiman died purposefully <laughs> to reach the stars we don't actually uh, know. The land one is that guy who built space. a rocket. Yeah, yeah. So yeah. Land is that guy who built a rocket. There's a slow dramatic sequence where Ashling like looks at all his friends on the beach and then turns around and walks into the ocean. <laughs> turns into a bad everyone's whale. clapping <laughs> for <laughs> Ashling. Congratulations! You're finally and a then, whale. And then a book closes, uh, and Nikolaj has written this all down. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. And Nikolaj's kid, like grandkid, is sitting in the um, in the bed. Is like, Grandpa Nikolaj, <laughs> tell me another one. <laughs> yeah, uh, it becomes the I, princess. I guess bride. kissing in stories is okay. <laughs> yeah. Ah. <laughs> uh, so what happens? <laughs> okay. <laughs> yeah, Brendan. So what happens? Um, this fucking idol explodes. <laughs> Hell yeah! Just Great. goes up in a column of fire. Fuck. God, I think. Um, yes. Are we in risky position now? Is that appropriate? For I don't four thi- sixes. Here's what I'm going to say. Here's what I'm going to say. I think to. I think I'm going to do the RPG thing where when you target a creature and it turns out they're already dead by the time your turn comes around, you auto attack someone else. <laughs> um, Fantastic. Two of these idols are just dead. You have just oh, yeah. lit them up. They explode into blue fire. They just scream themselves into oblivion. The other uh, idols are like stunned at this interruption to the point where it's like, they are like looking around to trying to figure out what the hell just happened. What is going on? However, that is such an, that is such an outpouring of violence that I think it is going to draw the attention of one of the Neros. It is not attacking you but it is going to start investigating soon. I cool. Okay. Hey, where did Whisper go? Don't worry about it. Uh, you, uh, haven't, okay. you haven't seen Whisper. That feels fine. What's uh-huh. Whisper? Weren't they poking their head out of a hole like a horse? <laughs> uh, like horses do? The hole that you saw them disappear into when they got shot. Absolutely. <laughs> You have not heard a okay. second sniper rifle shot. <laughs> you know, normal horse behavior. Oh, that's bad. That's bad, and I don't like it. We should fuck up this ritual. Yeah. Uh, or do we want to try to complete it, but twist it to our own ends? Nope. Okay. <laughs> nope. Okay. Uh, <laughs> Just have to put it out there. Oh, we didn't even <laughs> use black shot for that. We did. Oh, I assumed, I assumed we were. Were we not? We would have. Oh, if you used black shot. Yeah, I, I I marked off a check of mine. 
Do we get ticks on the clock? Well, this is the tick, the clock for the, this is the bad clock. Yeah. No, I was just Oh, thinking. okay. Okay. Ta- I, I wasn't, I wasn't. Time sure. of day to stop looking at bad clock and start looking at good clock. Mm. Um, Wisdom. <laughs> I was yeah. trying to think. There's just too close to tra- say whisper ritual zero of eight. I was I was just trying to think like how many ticks you would get on this clock. Um, y'all rolled. I'm just gonna. I'm looking at it again. Uh, <laughs> two of you one. had only one only one die die, and yet yeah. mm-hmm. all four of you rolled six. Uh huh. Yeah. Yeah. Um, he, we sure did. Here is what I think is true. Those two idols are dead, and these four fucking run away. Hell yeah. Okay. Baller. Did Whisper run away? You don't know where Whisper is. Whisper is hanging out with Sarah Colley. What okay. I said about the Sky Serpent is still true. Sure. Okay. But for the moment, yes. there is n- there's no problems. All right. Uh, it's like a capture the flag thing. We need to, like, then occupy this space. <laughs> Yeah, fill uh, st- uh, stand or king of the hill until the until the clock fills up. Mm-hmm. Soldiers investigate that crater. Nerds, <laughs> Richard, <laughs> just plants. He doesn't say nerds. He he doesn't. I say was nerds. about to say uh, specialists. Uh, that's me. The ritual. <laughs> Come on, nerds. Yeah. <laughs> so they was the king of the nerds. Yeah. So I make my own mm. crown. Ashling, I want you to make sure Whisper isn't over there while everyone else investigates this ritual. Um, okay. Ashling, are you by yourself or are there other soldiers with you? Uh, I'm sending all the soldiers there. Okay. So, oh, uh, to like watch whisper. the hole? <laughs> no, to go see if the hole is fill of Whisper. <laughs> um, whisper is not here, but there's black blood splattered everywhere. Uh, hmm. Well, Suleyama will want a sample of that. Uh, I lick my lips looking at the black blood as my eyes uh, get even more bloodshot. Great. Oh, buddy. <laughs> Just so. I think Rahel, like, <laughs> grabs your shoulders, like, keep it together. <laughs> Ashley has, like, a rage timer on missions. It's, like, slowly <laughs> fills. <laughs> um, let's do a, let's do a, how do we fit, stop this ritual? Yeah, uh, nerds. Yeah. So tell me what you do That's here. A- um, does Sarah Kali, sorry, does Sarah Kali, does Suleiman give us something here? Um, Can we use his expertise to be like, what did they use I don't use think this, this is his expertise. <laughs> yeah. Weird materials? Hmm. Hacking no. things? I think when it comes to like determining the purpose of the thing, probably not. Okay, that's fair. He's a, he's mm. a very practical sciences kind of guy. True. Is there anything that he could help with with like being able to... F- tell what they like i don't know if there's any weird substances or materials that being used here but could he tell that yeah if anyone's gonna know weird materials it's him yeah that'll give you an increased effect hell yeah it's a group research is that what we're doing i think a group research makes a lot of sense yeah um i'll lead it i think i think i have the most stress to burn i have i've i've only taken two how many oh no i've taken three Okay, I have taken two. Let me let me leave. Okay, this. sure, sure. Uh, so this is group research. What's position and effect? And yeah, you're such. desperate great with uh, Slamon's help. Um, is it group research if it's just you two? Uh, that gives us the most times. Okay, so yes, it is. <laughs> <laughs> uh, well, then I can help. I have a a die in research. Okay, sweet. Um. Lance is something of a scientist himself, you know. <laughs> Just I've hung out with Suleiman enough. Can um, find books and scrolls help? Yes. That a, should boost effect. Uh, hmm, I don't know. Can, can we get beyond the great? Yeah, I don't know that it would help you more than Suleiman already helping. Sure. You know what's happening? Okay, that's a total of five die. I feel pretty good about five die. Um, okay. Um... Actually, I've been here before. Oh, oh of course. Yay. Um, this is where Nabane was born. Aw. Ah. I established a long, long time ago at this point. Yeah, yeah. That Nabane was named Palisade because his parents misunderstood what Palisade meant. They yes. thought it meant near the palace, as in mm-hmm. near like the Imperial Palace. 
Uh, that's not what it means. It means cliffs. Um, <laughs> uh, but that's that's where Nabane's name come from. So I think he's ran these streets as a kid. Excellent. I thought you said Randy how, Streets. How, like that was a name. How does Randy that help? Streets, my best friend, researching this weird ritual in the middle of the um, plaza. Because I know what this place used to look like. Okay. And so I know how they've made changes to it. For sure. Oh, this area got gentrified. <laughs> the, the, never the worst gentrified. <laughs> uh, so this is two d six. Desperate, great group research. Yeah. Yeah. For you. Uh, that's a five. There's a five. That's a six. There's a six. Nice. That, that's the last die, too. Worth it. Oh, uh, why, why didn't it work? I don't know. Oh, there oh, we that's go. That's one there it failure. Okay. I will take one stress. That's fine. C- glad I could help. <laughs> <laughs> have you thought about, is it magic? <laughs> Lance, have you thought about yeah. magic? We all just Maybe look at Lance. Maybe we should about Never this. mind. Takes oh, a step we back. Should, we should just wait for Walut. Walut's the star star person it's true from over at the crater will loot his glaring at lands. um yeah ask me a question i think oh, you get three, three questions here all oh, right thinking um okay let's start with um what is the fastest way to stop this ritual not safest but fastest the fastest way to stop this ritual is to complete it. Uh, with okay, <laughs> all right, <laughs> all right, genie that I should have used different wording for. I, 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 I mean, I mean that in a very like. I think there is a degree of like interconnectivity. Like this is a deeply sophisticated thing that you've stumbled across. Yeah, um, and you can um, untangle it absolutely. But it would be much faster if you could find a way to like repurpose it and then complete it. Okay. Nicolaj rubs hands. Do we have? Mm, do we want to spend a question on asking if we have what we need to change it to something else? Oh no, I think we've got Walut here. Oh. <gasps> um. Well, so let's let's talk about this as players for just a second. Mm-hmm. What are what are we interested here? Because I think there is a version of this where we got we got star stuff coming down. We have a star person here, right? There's a natural mm-hmm. thing where we use this to like supercharge our Walut. I think that is something that would be difficult for me to see these characters getting to, though, because yeah. Walut herself is so against any of that stuff. Yeah, I think that like if Lance gives the order. Like if Lance looking over the shoulders of Nabane and Nikolaj is like, oh, star stuff. We'll just we'll get Walut to deal with it. I think that's a that's a way we could get there. But I think that leads to Walut becoming insubordinate. Yeah, I can see that. Which is interesting. Is there a way that, that is Are we interested in like that is interesting. And I have a really interesting yes. And that follows from that. OK. Um, mm. Just just to put that out there. I, I do want to point out that the only person who has ever given Walut agency is not on this mission right no, I'm aware. so like yeah so like lance saying oh we need we should get with loot here could have could start with like well loot what do your star eyes see mm-hmm. and then become oh we could pump this star stuff into you and that will stop the ritual yeah also if will loot shows any hesitance for this order ashling's going to back her up based off of the conversation that he had with Lance earlier. Yeah. We also don't know, like, what is what is the end goal of bringing down this line of star? Like, that could be a question. They going we to, have two more. Yeah. Yeah, do we want to ask that? Like, what is the star coming down supposed to do? For Whisper in the original version of this, Rich, that's a fair thing to ask. Question is, what is this intended to do? Yeah, I think that's our second one. Mm-hmm. So I think you can see you nerds uh, that are looking at the way that this thing works. I say this every time. That it is not merely that the sky is coming down, but that the horizon is rising to join it. Oh. And there is some greater effect. Well, I think we already that, knew that from your description. Yes. But this is 
accelerating it. Okay. This is fast forwarding to a point where the edge of the world begins to cascade. Are they going to eat Zell Shell? I don't even think it's like that. That might be in the cards. Mm -hmm. Um, But I think what is already present is that you realize you've been here before, right? Yep. Um, there That's not are. The main choice. <laughs> <laughs> um, yes. <laughs> Perfect. There are paths through the dirt and the brick that have been eroded that you don't remember. Hmm. That are here that look as though they are 50 or 60 years old. Um, hmm. And they're dry now, but you can tell that in a couple hours, they're going to be flowing again. Deeper mm. and deeper. Are they? Oh, mm. they're feeding something beneath? No. Oh. Hmm. Like a river running through here? What? Not a river. The sea. Uh. The horizon is getting pulled up and the mm. sea will flood across Zelshael. Oh. Okay, Waterworld Zelshael. So the dead god that is the sky prefers soup. Okay. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I mean, the sky is kind of a soup. The sky is kind of a soup. The ocean is monster soup. Go ahead. Prove now. Matzah ball Zelshael soup. Um. <laughs> okay. My... My okay, aunt so- made matzo ball. Sorry, sorry. <laughs> uh, my aunt made matzo balls with chilies in them, and it was the best thing I've ever, like, best matzo ball soup I've ever had. That sounds really good. Anyway, um, are we interested in trying to find a way to just reverse it? Is that an option for finishing it? Um. So I think we have one more question. Yep. Yeah, I think there's a version of this where we decide to go all in on a uh, super powered Woolute plan. Or at least uh, using Woolute like a living battery, probably chill. Mm. And the last question is about how to do that in the safest way possible. Right. I have a third idea or yeah. another idea. Sure, sure, sure. Um, the, the one other thing I wanted to say besides that one is, Chris, your suggestion of uh, how would we go about reversing it which wouldn't be the slowest or the fastest way to deal with this but it would be probably a safer way to deal with this i mean like i i i guess i was asking like is there a way that is finishing this but because like brendan said to finish it or like alter it and then see it through to the end yeah. would be the fastest way is there a way to alter it so that it goes in reverse probably because then that still might be the fastest anyway gavin what was your thing uh so we're here to distract mm-hmm and if uh-huh. the never are like, fuck these guys, they're too strong, mm-hmm. that's not a good distraction. We need So like a question be like, how can we set this ritual so that it will bring Whisper and company back mm. or keep their attention away from the people we're trying to smuggle into the city? I think when it becomes clear that we're going to fuck up their ritual, Whisper's coming back. I feel pretty confident on that. Which I guess is to say, not the fastest way to fuck up this ritual, but the slowest way. Hey, Captain, should I plug up this hole with the bodies we made? (laughs) No. Okay, let let, let me, let's start here. Uh, Is there anybody who's gunning for Woolute Star Battery? I think it's interesting, but I'm not not very, like, keen on it. I'm like... It it makes me feel icky and not like in a good way. Yeah, I think it's pretty manipulative. Yeah, I don't care. For if there's it. a way to like frame it that like she is like getting in tune with her power and it's like kind of a cool thing. I don't. I don't think she's at I that don't position. Don't see that? Yeah. No. Yeah, I don't. She's not at that. The point. last time she was like last set last last mission, she was like, "No, fuck all of this. Yeah, I'm gonna go learn how to be a scout." Yeah. Um. Okay. So let's let's strike that one off the table. So then, uh. Gavin, you were asking what's the slowest way to do this, uh, or the, maybe what's the loudest way? Yeah, to do this? Right, yeah, that's maybe the, that's more of more the thing. Um, and Chris, you were asking uh, how about reversing it. Mm-hmm. Um, so maybe there's a way we can we can ask both of these things 
in terms of asking <laughs> um, what's the loudest way to reverse the ritual. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, Brendan? Oh, don't worry about me. Just rolling some dice. Cool. Yep. Um, uh, I don't like that. Okay, final question. What's the loudest way to reverse this ritual? Mm, um, so I think this thing is really powerful in terms of joining the the land and the sky together. Yeah. But the the targets for those things are kind of broad, uh, mm-hmm. necessarily so, since they're targeting, you know, all of Zelshel and all of the dead god of the sky. Um, mm-hmm. And so you could probably figure out some sort of configuration of, like, new targets that are, mm. like necessarily destructively recursive or something like that mm-hmm. that um that you could basically like reprogram it in order to to achieve your ends so like what if we pulled the sky into the sky uh that's Reverse definitely the polarity that's definitely a thing you could do yes oh what if we pulled the never into the sky that would certainly be a distraction just zero g all these never <laughs> Uh, not just zero G, right? Because it would actually be like a uh, tractor beam. We're going to tractor beam all these never. So long as it goes never towards sky and not sky towards never. Right. Well, the, the sky is bigger, so I think we're good on that. I'm, I'm game for that. I think pull all the never into the sky is great. Sure. Absolutely. It's distracting as Gavin wanted. It's loud. And also, it would ideally keep us fairly safe because all the never are being pulled upwards away from us and our friends. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Send the never to Australia. Let's go. That's okay. how that works. <laughs> mm-hmm. All right. Um, cool. So I think, can we say that that last question was basically in game Nabane and Nikolaj like theory crafting a ritual to do that together. Yeah, 100%. Okay. Though I do just love the idea of Suleiman being like, we send all the never to the sky. Oh, yeah. <laughs> this is a Suleiman plan <laughs> for sure. <laughs> he, he goes, nerds, nerds, it is simple. Mm-hmm. Send all never into sky. You crazy bastard. It's just clever enough to work. <laughs> well, Brandon, I thought you weren't playing Lance. <laughs> cool. What kind of clock are we looking at, Brennan? Boy, oh boy. I think this is this is an eight step. OK. OK. Send never into sky. What fucking action would you roll for? Yeah, this? just wondering, like, how is do we? Just research. Maybe this is research in terms of like a trying to find something, and it's like Nicolaj and Nobane like harmonizing together, trying to find like the right tunes to do the opposite of what. And Suleiman sees it, and he's like, "Yes, more of that, more of that." Yeah, exactly. Suleiman's <laughs> tuning us. Yeah, I'm into that. <laughs> Okay. Let's I mean, do if, another, it, if it helps um, at all, uh, Ashling's probably good at like reading the stars and like using a sextant and things like that from being a sailor. Oh, sure. Yeah. Ooh, I like that. That's dope. Um, if you want to represent that as a as a help die, sure. I think that would certainly be. I think that's great. Appreciated. Yeah. yeah. Um, Nikolaj, want to take that? This is a Nikolaj and Ashling. Sure. Thing. Um, I am still one, two, three, four, five stress away from death. How many stress you yeah, got, same. Nicolaj? Just five? Exact same. Okay. Um, let's let's trade off. Let's let Nicolaj take uh, yeah, sure. on this one. I am there. Okay. So Nicolaj has something called a divination kit, but I don't know what that is. I'm wondering if it would help, though. Um, this, this is weird ritual business. I do remember that. Yes. Yeah. Because it's not, there's, there's no in the book no, for that. No, we, we made it up. Um, excellent. Yeah. Yeah. Let's say it helps. Great. Uh, yeah. you want in on this, uh, Lance? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> All right. Give us one. <laughs> was the last research desperate? Cause I forgot to tick XP. Oh, you should have. Yeah, it was. Desperate. Oh, it yeah. was okay. desperate. Oh, hell yeah. Okay. I forgot about that. Also. We just keep getting so. Since we've never really seen them on screen together, I think, uh, Ashling, uh, talks to Nikolaj a little bit while they're working, uh, on this and is like, Oh yeah, I, 
I I docked at your home a couple of times. I'm I'm sorry about all that. I lost a lot of my friends to this guy. Yes, the islands are a, a, a perilous place to be, but uh, best we prevent the rest of Selshael from that from that fate. R two D six. You're getting help from Ashling. Oh yeah. Three D six. Six 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 six. Whoa! <laughs> <laughs> what? Oh. Avray says oh, error okay, in roll. Okay. Unexpected input on line one. Col one colon expected you underscore op. What is all this? <laughs> Whoa! Crit! Crit! Whoa! <laughs> See, you just you just have to ask. It turns out. Talk about the sky. <laughs> You should uh, get an error every time before you roll, Chris. I should just ask, please. <laughs> and Avray apparently will will be like, thank you. Uh, Nikolaj, take one stress as Nabane fucks this up, but then you seriously outperform everybody else here. Yeah, this just turns into Iliander star navigation. Yeah. And I, I know I hyped you up by reminding you that your <laughs> homeland fell into the sky. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Just a reminder of like, sure don't want that to follow us here, huh? <laughs> It's just Nicolaj and Ashley just sharing a look of like, mm. yeah, let's fix this. Let's let's not have that happen again here. Jesus Christ. OK, I think Nabane was uh, distracted by the never uh, and it was his full full heart was not in on this. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. That said, you uh, this is not your first rodeo. You are able, I think, to begin, particularly with Suleiman, um helping out. Um, <laughs> Uh, to begin stitching this thing back into into a form to your liking. Two things happen. One, you hear a sniper shot ring out. Mm. Oh. And two, the Neros that had been circling, I think, begins to close in. Yeah, that makes sense. Um, we are right out in the open, ain't we? Yep. This clock is ah. now over halfway because it should be five right and so is oh this i guess it is doing yeah is this doing something like visual to because you were talking about how like the sky was like dipping down hmm i think the stars that had been like slow motion streaking down have paused mm -hmm. i don't know if they've begun like shooting back up or anything like that yet right um, well, they wouldn't necessarily. It's just the 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 never right, going to start yeah, being a little little lighter on their feet. <laughs> um, I think the clock has to finish first. Uh, okay, fair. Yeah, I was just hoping mm -hmm. we were causing some kind of distraction before then. I almost picture like we're getting the start of like Star Tracks, mm -hmm. like you know when people take those time lapse, yeah, uh, yeah, yeah. Uh, photos of the sky. Yeah, for sure. Sure. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hey, Captain. Like we can see some movement. Hey, Captain. Do you have any orders regarding that? Putting at the fucking thing in the sky circling us does it see us is it like yeah, actively coming. circling us us it hasn't like attacked but it is definitely circling closer it is investigating the situation like serpent winding in um okay yeah clip its wigs vipers jesus it's <laughs> <laughs> pretty good it's a snake you're snakes yeah it just makes sense. <laughs> snake type is super effective against snake type. Uh, I guess this is a discipline because I'm, I'm not telling everyone. I guess everyone could shoot here. It but probably like, is all the soldiers at least, right? Yeah. So I'm going to make this a discipline to, as a set of action, I guess. Okay. I was thinking, what if I try to, 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 to ground it with my anchor? Oh, <gasps> sick. You're going to throw your anchor up there? Is it that? Yeah, how high up is if, it? If we, can, if we can, you know, uh, pull it down a little bit, like get its attention to swoop at it. I do have an extra channels, but I, I don't think I want to use it on that. Um, no, I, I think shooting it in the wings so that it, it falls and lands on some abandoned, hopefully, buildings. And then once it's like weak point, it's exposed, and I go at it with my anchor. Yeah. <laughs> if it gets close enough. It's flashing weak point. Yeah. It's like a Zelda mm -hmm. boss. Um <laughs> Okay, so R two D six disciple despera. Yeah, let's go. It's a five. All right. Mm -hmm. 
Um, you get a desperate consequence here. I think at that, at clip its wings, then it shrieks and it dives and it collides with part of the building near Lance and it tumbles and collapses near you. Take the level three harm buried alive. 